thousands of gallons of sewage floating in Lake San Marcos. The water near the shore, we're told, is neon green. Dentist reporter Craig Herrera explains what's being done to clean up this mess. And here are the signs. Keep out sewage contaminated water. I made a friend who took me out on a boat to go around the lake. Something's happening. This North County oasis. We fish out here, not that we eat any, but uh, you sure don't want to see a bunch of floaters up here if the water has gotten polluted with all that sewage. Something's contaminated. Happened. Never had anything like this happen before. Joe Veraldi has lived in Lake San Marcos three years. I saw these signs posted out here, but there wasn't anything that we got any calls or text messages or anything as far as I know. Boats are docked. So we don't have human contact with the water. Kayaks hung up, but it doesn't stink. Veraldi is worried about the wildlife. We got all kinds of birds here. It's really cool. Black swans, white swans. Some are in the fluorescent green water. I wouldn't think it would be good for them to be drinking any of this water today. This sewer line broke last night. The nuts and bolts just wore out over time. It just kind of tore off the top or the bonnet of the valve and then, you know, it, it comes loose. Sewage went right into this storm drain and out into the lake through this outlet. Well, between 40,000 and 60,000 gallons. Water samples are being analyzed. It'll take two to three days to get the results. You think things are built better than that for the, the, the handle of our infrastructure, you know, but I guess things wear out. Vicito's Water District says they're going to go around and check all of the units and make sure that they're secure. From Lake San Marcos, Craig Herrera, 10 News. And breaking news here.